are back with another video video so today's video i'm going to be talking about um mortal kombat scorpion's revenge i'll put a picture right here so you guys can see and i'm gonna just like be saying my opinions my thoughts about it because you know i feel like talking about it and sharing it with you guys so before we get into this video don't make sure to like comment share and subscribe 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 turn on that notification bell so you don't miss a video and let's get started so my um thoughts about this movie is actually positive like mainly positive because it it shows like you know a lot of um uh relation to um Mortal Kombat 9 and if you guys haven't like played Mortal Kombat 9 you guys should play it like the story mode play the story mode because it actually relates back to that the movie relates back to the game Mortal Kombat 9 and also um I'm going to be spoiling so if you guys don't like spoilers please do not click this video I warned you please do not click this video if you haven't watch the movie or if you haven't played the story mode on mk9 because it kind of it relates so what i was saying um yeah like i said it kind of relates to um mk9 story mode to me it relates and um i feel like it's like you know i feel like the the story the the story of um scorpion um in the movie was like very um more um in depth and um explain a lot about like where he came from because like in the games you don't really know like where he came from um it's not really explained because they don't have time to do that in games and movies they have more time because it's a movie and um it, it explains more so i like how that scorpion has um you know have a, a more explanation of who he is where he came from you know how did he turn into um you know this person that um that just wanted yeah revenge because you know quan chi um killed his family and killed his clan so he wants to get revenge um and i like how you know they they showed that you know they showed that he wanted revenge because obviously it says scorpion's revenge in the movie you know and movie title so i feel like it was like you know it was good to me it was positive it wasn't it wasn't something negative for me to view as because like scorpion um used to be my favorite character in mortal kombat um but now he's not but yeah so i feel like you know it, it was like very like very very um detailed and very um there was like a lot of explanation going on um another part i liked about the movie is that um it was not only about scorpion but it was about more of the other characters as well i know you don't really see them as much in the movie but i feel like it they was more evolved because it was not only about Scorpion to begin with because everybody, like, you know, Raiden, he picked, like, um, Sonya, Liu Kang, and, um, Johnny Cage, um, to be, like, you know, to beat, um, Outworld because, you know, as they explained, the, uh, um, Shao Kahn, he won nine, he won nine of the, um, tournaments and if he won the last one, the tenth one, um, you know, Earthworm will be in trouble. Like, you know, they will have consequences and they will just be in trouble. So, you know, it, it shows that, you know, that it wasn't only about Scorpion to begin with. It was about also, you know, making Earthrealm, like saving Earthrealm. So, yeah. Um, I liked how Johnny Cage, like, he was really funny. Um, he is known for f being funny, you know, so... It, it brings humor to the movie because if without humor i feel like it wouldn't you know it would just be all serious and who wants to be serious in you know the movie like because i know there are like serious movies but this movie was actually fun funny because john cage and um it was very re like very good to me and um it showed that you know whatever happened in mk9 they 
they actually explain more in the movie and you know um it was really it was really it was really good so uh i will rate this movie uh, uh ten, yeah 10 out of 10 i'll give it a 10 out of 10 because like i said like i liked how um it was very detailed it was very um it explained a lot about scorpion's story it explained like how he was you know be like you know was being very like he was being violent for a reason like and i feel like you know people that they, they don't be violent just to be violent they be violent because something happened to them in their life something happened you know it's either they look they abandon like a fa they, a family member abandoned them like or they just like yeah they're um they're somebody killed their family or it's many things to why people become violent it's not just they do, they become violent out of the blue like it's always a reason to why somebody become you know who they are or you know how they became that in the first place it's always a reason so i feel like you know um yeah it was it was good to how he became like that you know because he wasn't like that he was probably like you know a good person a good man you know but now he wanted revenge and he became a violent person um he became somebody that you know just wanted peace and wanted to be with his family again because he lost his family he lost his family so i feel like you know he wanted to get he wanted he just wanted to destroy the person who killed his family in the first place and it's not sub zero it's quan chi because he um you quan chi used his sorcery to you know um be um to impersonate sub zero and yeah so i feel like you know, it just, it all relates back to MK9 in the end. It just all relates back to MK9 of the story mode. And, yeah, that's it. I guess that's it, right? Yeah, so comment down below all of your thoughts of um this movie. And, you know, what you guys think about it. Because I really want to know. And I want to, like, start a conversation in the comment section. Because you guys, you guys haven't been, like, you know, commenting and... I feel like, you know, getting your ideas and like, you know, me seeing your ideas, I want to be able to talk about it with you guys because, you know, just don't be shy. Like, you know, it's through a screen anyway. Just like. Anyway, so like I said, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, 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 subscribe. Turn on that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Make sure you turn it on because I can see, I can see, I can see. Anyway, I'm going to be going now, and um, I hope you guys have a good day, a good rest of the, a, a good, sorry guys, I can't talk today. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I hope your day is going well. And um, yeah, bye guys, peace.